in this interesting question given is a circle with the quadrilateral inscribed in it if the side lengths of the quadrilateral are given we have to find the radius of circle let's check the solution let's start by joining the diagonal of quadrilateral ac let's assume this angle d here is alpha degrees thus this angle b we know that in a cyclic quadrilateral the opposite angles are supplementary so angle b will be 180 minus alpha to proceed further we'll use cosine rule which states that in a triangle with side a b and c a square is b square plus c square minus 2 bc cos a where a is the angle opposite to side length a so using this cosine rule in triangle adc we get ac square is 5 square plus 4 square minus 2 times of 5 times 4 times cos alpha simplifying it will get our equation in this form same cosine rule will apply in triangle abc so here we'll have ac square is 2 square plus 3 square minus 2 times 2 times 3 times cos of angle b or 180 minus alpha but we know that in trigo cos of 180 minus alpha is nothing but minus cos alpha so replacing this and simplifying it will get ac square as 13 square and this negative will become positive so plus 12 cos alpha now from this second equation we'll subtract our first equation on subtracting we'll get this ac square on both side will get cancel down so 13 minus 41 that's minus 28 and 12 cos alpha minus of minus 40 cos alpha so that becomes plus 52 cos alpha simplifying it we'll get cos alpha as 28 by 52 So simplifying it further it will get cancelled by 4 we'll get cos alpha is 7 by 13 we'll put value of this cos alpha in this equation to get ac square as 13 plus 12 times of 7 by 13 simplifying it will get ac square as 253 by 13 or ac as square root of 253 by 13 here cos alpha is known and the length of diagonal ac is known with the help of cos alpha we can find value of sin alpha using this formula putting value of cos alpha as 7 by 13 we'll get sin alpha as 2 root 30 upon 13 now further we'll use sin rule sin rule in a triangle it states that a upon sin a is b upon sin b is c upon sin c which is equals to 2 times of circum radius radius which is passing through the vertex of the triangle so here we'll apply this sin rule in this particular triangle acd so instead of a we'll take the side ac and the sin a will become sin alpha so we'll get ac upon sin alpha is 2 times of circum radius or the radius of the circle which we have to find putting the values of ac as square root of 253 by 13 and sin alpha is this we'll get value of 2r in this form simplifying it we'll get r as square root of 329 upon 4 root 30 solving simplifying it further we'll get r as 2.61 cm and that's our answer i hope you enjoyed the solution i will see you in next video Till then, Tata. Bye bye.